you ask you about um, IPOB and all that, mm -hmm. you stood short for uh, Namdi Kano. Mm -hmm. At the time when the John Bill, what was going through your mind? <laughs> no, at the, at the time that he escaped, you know, because you know he said to himself. And even said it. Yeah, it. Uh, it just in that, jumping and, 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 and even when he came to court uh, the other day, he said, I ran for my life. So there are two things about jumping bail and escaping for your life. So I think we need to always make that very, very clear. So at the time that he ran for his life, all that happened was that we said, okay, so we'll go back to court and make our case and i came back to court and i went to the judge and we made a deposition mm -hmm. and said that on the basis of the legal principle of last seen mm -hmm. that the last people that were seen with him were the soldiers of the nigerian army who were uh, invading his um, residence his father's residence where he was staying and therefore they have the responsibility of talking about what happened mm -hmm. and we deposed it in court and the matter went to court and the judge ultimately ruled that they are revoking bail you know most Nigerians didn't know that the judge had actually revoked the bail mm -hmm and uh, issued a warrant of arrest. of arrest, thereby removing us from responsibility again of providing him. Mm. Yeah, that's what happened. Not many people know this. Yeah, a lot of people don't mm. know. Yeah, so that's why when a lot of people <laughs> were shouting, oh, go and bring a body, we let him produce him. I just <laughs> laughed because I knew, <laughs> I knew that uh, they were not on any strong legal uh, uh, foundation. Amen. Did you at any point um, think that you could be put in this lama over his um, no, I never, escape? I, no, no, I never, I never always, I was always sure because I'm, my, the facts, of course, were very, very... Uh, Man, you didn't feel betrayed that um, he did that to you? No, I didn't feel, I said he escaped for his life, so he couldn't have been betrayal. You know. But he didn't communicate with you. And you well, that. Uh, well, if, if he if he is running for his life, I expect him to be communicating with me. <laughs> How would he communicate? I, I was I was as surprised as anybody when uh, after that whole drama, mm -hmm. he, he surfaced in uh, Israel, and I immediately filed wrote a letter to the Foreign Affairs Ministry yes. asking the Nigerian the Foreign Affairs to instruct our Nigerian ambassador in uh, Israel to ascertain whether the person that we see in his photographs is actually this person. I never got a response from our Foreign Affairs uh, Minister because and and, and uh, that letter that I wrote and all that I also filed it yes. in court because I, I I always following the legal and proper procedure. I never got any response. I didn't hear anything again. And uh, of course, um, we, we part of the ruling hmm. of uh, the uh, judge in this matter, we we had also. Um, uh, gone on appeal, you know, and the matter is still pending. But now that you know, there's another. This I don't. I don't think that that matter would be. If they were to um, grant him bail again, would you stand? <laughs> would you be willing to? If the circumstances are the same, why not? My the 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 first circumstance was that the uh, judge said that they need hmm. a senator okay. you know to uh, be part of his uh shorties hmm. and, and, and so if a judge turns out again and says this is also the 
this thing. I don't see why. I'm a senator of the Federal Republic. I come from the Southeast. I'm the chairman. Uh, I'm the minority leader. At that time, I was chairman of the Southeast Caucus. Right now, the chairman of the Southeast Caucus is in Kekwere Madrid. So maybe if such a, a situation uh, as chairman, he would not have <laughs> <defeat it to him. laughs> well, I, I don't think that uh, we will run away from our responsibility. He's our son. Mm, mommy's He's from our state. So our son is from our state. And um, we think also that despite everything, there are fundamentals that we must deal with. And those fundamentals is what we need to actually focus on. Yes. And that fundamental is, what is it about this particular government that is leading to this type of alienation from component parts? Because it's not just Namdekan. Ibo is also there somewhere insisting that they, uh, they should also go their way. It's not just him. Mm. Uh, so, and, and uh, we, what we thought really was that um, the first things first, you don't deal with the symptom, you try to deal with what is it that has led to these symptoms. Uh, we think that the symptoms are the cries for, mm. you know, that, and at the basis of it is what. Uh, my Thomas Sule and uh, a few uh, northern leaders of thought when they went to meet with uh, President Buhari after his election in 2015 and they said to him justice is the basis for whatever everybody will do. If you do justice to all then you will have no problem. And we think that that is the problem. Justice. Thank you so much, uh, my senator. It's my pleasure. My pleasure. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. I prefer.